All right, Bernard Hopkins versus Sergei Kovalev. This is an excellent fight, and it's uh, one that Bernard Hopkins wants. You know, th this is quite possibly the number one and number two guys in the light heavyweight division. Additionally, um, Adonis Stevenson is in the woodworks not wanting to fight either one. So, um, hopefully Adonis Stevenson can go ahead and fight a Jean Pascal or a, a, a contender, an up-and-coming contender. You know, I want to see him fight an undefeated guy. I don't give a fuck who. Um, and I want to see this fight. Bernard Hopkins versus Sergei Kovalev is an excellent, excellent fight where Kovalev is well-schooled. He's got a heck of a punch. And Bernard Hopkins is this, um, this, like, elders, man. He's a fucking legend. And he's still kicking ass. And he constantly wants to challenge himself and fight the best fighters out there. And that's what he's doing at age fucking 49, going 50. This is an excellent fight. I can't wait. Um, if, you know, it, there's no reason why it can't happen. It's just a matter of... Of the network war behind the promotional war. That's the worst stuff part. Because fucking uh, fighters that are continuously on HBO. You know if they go to Showtime. You know guess who else is there. Donna Stevenson, Bernard Hopkins. Those are stars in the sport. And Kovalev's got to make the job. I don't give a fuck if he's got to fight Showtime or HBO. Make this fight happen. I don't give a fuck which network he's on. Kovalev make the jump to Showtime. Fight fucking Bernard Hopkins. Etch yourself in history right now. It's history for both fighters. Because I think these are... I, I truly believe this is the number one and number two light heavyweight in the world. We saw a similar matchup in July. And I would like to see that happen once again in the light heavyweight division. Because this has really always been a clear division with... Uh, with True champion number one, undisputed. Uh, you know, Roy Jones held this division down for years. Uh, Bernard Hopkins came into the picture and now, once again, is outlasting every single fucking fighter. Um, you know, Bernard Hopkins goes way back and, and he's really one of the greatest fighters of this era. So, you know, I appreciate how long this guy has been in the sport, and he's got a lot of classics under his belt, and this could be another one. And this is a very stern test, especially um, at this age of Hopkins' careers. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, for sure, this will not be his last fight.